Hey everyone, Dr. Eric Jackson here. Wanted to jump on and discuss a very important part of family and pediatric dentistry with you today, uh, space maintainers. Now, what is a space maintainer? Well, the most common is a unilateral space maintainer. It looks just like this photo right here. And when do we use these things and why would we use them? Well, typically it's two main reasons. Um, a baby tooth in your child's mouth is recommended to be extracted, sometimes because of trauma, sometimes because of, of cavities. But an extraction of a baby tooth before the adult tooth is ready to come out is a problem. Um, the reason for that is basically the baby tooth is meant to keep the space proper for between all the teeth and hold that space that's necessary for the adult tooth to come through. If the tooth is lost and the space, uh, the space will actually close up and the teeth will start drifting and it's just not predictable anymore. So you'll get a much smaller space available, but the same size tooth will, will want to come up and not and be unable to do so. So it'll either be trapped in there and become impacted or it'll come out the side perhaps and, and give a malocclusion, a, a bad bite, if you will. Um, both of those things are clearly less than desirable and can cause a lot of other problems. So as with most things in dentistry, prevention, prevention, prevention. Um, if a tooth has to come out, well then the dentist will, and, and, and the space has to ma be maintained, the dentist will remove the tooth and propose a space maintainer, sometimes the same day, sometimes on a different day, and that space maintainer is simply cemented in until the missing tooth's adult uh, counterpart starts to come up through that space and then the, uh, the space maintainer can be removed. Uh, it's a very important thing because left unchecked, all that drifting, all the, the, the problems with the adult teeth, uh, they're going to have a lot of issues um, that have to be contended with after the fact. And it's always better to deal with these in the preventative realm as opposed to in, 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 in the proactive realm than the reactive realm, right? And so space maintainers are uh, simple, proven, and, and often overlooked as far as their importance because the immediacy is not there in the minds of many patients, but they are very important. So if your dentist proposes an extraction and uh, recommends a space maintainer, please listen to him or her about the reasons um, and then make a good informed decision. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it very much. If you like the video, go ahead and hit the like, uh, subscribe to the channel. If you like these kinds of videos, make sure you hit the bell to receive notifications. Select, uh, when you hit the bell, select all that way it'll pop up on your phone when, uh, when I release a new video. Um, as always, if you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Uh, and questions about this topic and any other topic. Always looking for good conversations with uh, the fantastic people online. So thank you so much for listening to me here today about some space maintainer information. Uh, I'll look, see, look forward to seeing you in the next video. Take care now. Bye-bye.